I live here with my partner and my medium sized dog. Uh, it's a 24 square meter apartment and we seem to get along fine. Cairo Apartments, it's an Art Deco building, completed in 1936, designed by Best Overend, with details of ocean liners and ships. I was interested in creating a suite of different spaces rather than completely clearing out walls and doors and turning it into one big space, and to draw focus on the existing details of the building, which I didn't want my design to compete or overtake with those, more I wanted it to complement them. The kitchens are sort of merge in between the toolbox and the cabinetry bench and then it sort of unfolds and opens up and everything has its place. The aesthetic and the way the kitchen is put together is to have a very simple kind of almost farm-like structural system that runs through it. The materials of the kitchen, driven by wanting things to be able to age and patina and develop a characteristic through use. So when the kitchen's closed, this, the space out here completely transforms into a sort of really nice, quiet space. Things in an apartment tend to be a bit more hybridised. The door is also a bookshelf and a pantry, and that allowed me to close the bedroom off and have a separate space. These apartments have quite generous ceiling height, so there's a crawl space underneath the bed, there's room for a washing machine, and there's a little sort of ladder which stores our shoes. The apartment faces north, so I get a lot of fantastic light without having to rely on too much artificial lighting during the day. All of my light fittings, they're hidden away in the joinery and they uplight the roof so the light gets a really beautiful wash. The original design of the bathroom also included a dressing room, so it's sort of a 19th century detail where there's a dressing room with a wash basin in there. I try to keep a continuity of materials throughout the whole apartment. The floor is the same in the bathroom as it is in the kitchen, as it is in the bedroom. And limiting those materials just means there's sort of less clutter in terms of transitions in between different rooms. Mm -hmm.